Alright friends, I'm uh, going to go ahead and give you a quick tutorial how to fuse video into your Excite Pro web page layouts. I'm going to go ahead and advise you, most likely if you're wanting to do this really quick and easy, go ahead and create your videos and then upload it to something like YouTube or Google Video because all of the code is pretty much in, uh, contained in one good little easy to use snippet here. So we're just for this example use this little demo page that I have for a digital product. Um, I already used uh, this for one tutorial, but let's just say this is a, a product that we're selling here, and we want to embed a preview video. Now I'm hoping everything will be a lot easier in Excite Pro version two, but uh, editing source code between Design View and Source View isn't so easy as I would like it to be. But let's just say we're going to be using the older version of Excite Pro because the new version is coming out soon. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you right here in my YouTube account that I actually already have a preview video made up for this little product here. And it's already uploaded to YouTube. Hopefully you know how to produce your video in, an, in a uh, either a WMV format or an AVI format which is easy to upload and, into your YouTube account. And then all you need right here is this embed code. So you highlight that, hit Control C for copy, and then switch back over to Excite Pro. Now, how I do this in this version is really easy. Wherever I want to put the video, I type the word replace, R-E-P-L-A-C-E. -E, and then you can switch over to your source view. Once you're in your source view, click anywhere in the source view and then hit Control F for find and type in the word replace and it'll hunt down that word replace well sometimes it doesn't I don't know why let's try again we'll go to the top and we say control F replace find next yep, there it is right there so we go ahead and isolate the word replace in fact we'll go ahead and isolate this entire this entire font section here from font all the way to end font we'll highlight the whole thing and then we go ahead and paste over it oh, that was close almost so we'll paste over it and there is the YouTube code right there if we switch back over to design view it'll only show this little thing it says object so we can always hit save and then you can preview it, but I already know it's going to look just how we want it to, so we'll go ahead and hit the publish button. And it will go ahead and up this, update this page for us. And we say OK. Now all we need to do is go ahead and hunt down the page. And here we are, and you can see here's our web page. And here is our YouTube video already incorporated in it, ready to play. And it is ready to go. Player and controls are already put in there for you. So this is, I think, the fastest and easiest way to get video onto just about anything. Um, the downside, obviously, it does say YouTube on here. Sometimes you don't want to s that to show up because, I don't know, maybe you happen to be selling something that you found for free on the internet and then you're like well I'm gonna package up package it up and sell it and somebody might have a weak version of the same kind of thing on YouTube and it might be not as easy to follow might be not as well done but if somebody's like hey this is on YouTube maybe I can go to YouTube and find other stuff and then they basically find whatever it is you're selling that doesn't really work out so well sometimes so sometimes YouTube is not the best route to go but most of the time it is it's the fastest and easiest way and pretty much it's the exact same if you go with Google Video. The big advantage to Google Video versus YouTube is um, is length of recording. YouTube can only be 10 minutes long whereas on Google Video you can have pretty much unlimited length to your videos if you want to upload with Google Video. And then Google Video, since Google owns YouTube, indexes all of the YouTube videos as well as all the Google Videos. Uh, another advantage that you have to your Google videos is that you can select um, like private a private setting where it's not published 
publicly so you get a link to it that you can email to friends and family and you can fuse it into your your own web page but people searching for whatever topic in Google are not going to find it because it's not posted in the search results so sometimes you want to do that but in any case that is the fastest quickest and easiest way to go ahead and get your video incorporated into your Excite Pro layouts simply by like I said copying your YouTube object code from your YouTube page which we see once again right here it's always directly to the right of your video and you just type replace wherever you want to go ahead and incorporate your actual video switch over to source view hunt down that word replace and then paste over it with your YouTube source code upload your page and you're good to go